Hey teachers, I've been receiving a lot of questions in my Q&A on TPT about how to edit the digital interactive notebook templates in Google Slides. So I just wanted to create a short video to give you some wins, um, to give you some tips and tricks on how to edit the templates. So one of the most frequently asked questions um, is in regards to the tabs and how do I change them? Um, what happens when I change them? Does it change the link? Uh, what should it link to? How do I change the link if I want to? So the page one is just the title page. So you could put title um, and see here when I did that, the link disappeared. So I right click, um, you can go to link or you can just um, select the text and hit control K. You could do it that way as well. Um, you go to slides in this presentation, click that. And always click instead of next slide, last slide. Don't um, don't use those because it'll kind of uh, mess up the formatting. Uh, click slide one and click apply. And then um, I like to have the underline removed, and you can change the color. It'll still keep the link even though it doesn't look like you know the typical blue link. Um, it'll still be there. So that's how you do that. Um, you know if if the tabs are bugging you, you can always just remove them. They're not necessary. I just like the look of it. I think it looks more like an authentic uh, interactive notebook with the tabs. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show you, you can edit. They don't, it doesn't have to be page one, page two, page three. You can edit them, you know, page three on, in this example is vocabulary. So I could, you know, have this say vocabulary, you know, vocab for students to just quickly, um, go to page three if they want to work on their vocabulary.